This is going to be one of the most important topics I've ever talked about by far. And this is something that if you want to be successful in really anything, whether we're talking about business, relationships, health, wellness, literally anything, this is a concept that you absolutely have to master immediately. The concept's called skin in the game. And what skin in the game means is that you are invested in something, it can be a lot of different things, that if it goes bad, it hurts you, but if it goes well, it benefits you. There's all these like stupid cliche terms that are made up to explain this, like you gotta risk it to get the biscuit, but it's actually really true if you think about it. Because let's just take stocks, for example, as a very, very basic, broad example, okay? So if I'm invested in Apple, right? Let's just say I put $100 into Apple stock. Well, if that stock tanks, it hurts me and I lose my $100. If it goes up, it benefits me and I get my money back. But the only way that I get that benefit is if I take on the risk of it going down to zero. Another example is relationships, right? So let's say I'm in a relationship with a romantic partner, okay? And I want this partner to love me and care for me and be there for me always. Okay, well, that's a great benefit. What are the cons? Well, and while these, not, my, while these might not be cons, you get what I'm saying. The cons are that I am unable to have sex with other people. I'm unable to get love and affection from other people. I have to kind of put on blinders and ignore other people so that I can get that extra attention and care and nourishing from that one person. So the skin in the game in this case is that I have this one person that's going to give me everything she's got and I have to avoid anything else from other potential opportunities. Unfortunately, we live in a society where there's a lot of lawmakers and policymakers that are creating rules and laws that don't necessarily benefit them because they don't have skin in the game. One problem is that we live in a society where we have these policymakers and these lawmakers that are making these laws, but they don't have skin in the game. It can only benefit them. It can't hurt them. So if you're looking for an ROI in any situation in life, you're trying to decide if you should move to the city, you're trying to decide if you should pursue this job, you're trying to decide what you need to do next, you need to consider the concept of skin in the game. Are you willing to take on the downsides in order to benefit from the upsides? I can use my own content creation journey as a great example of this, right? So I decided I'm going to create content just about every day for the rest of the year. And the upside is that I gain a lot of followers, I gain influence, I can probably generate some business off that. But the downside is that I spend an entire year, hundreds and hundreds of hours and times that I could spend sitting on the couch enjoying myself and nothing ever happens from it. I never get traction and it never comes back to me. Now to me personally, I would rather deal with that downside and that negative benefit to get the potential positive benefit, but that is skin in the game. I'm gonna give you a piece of advice really quickly. Never listen to someone on a subject that doesn't have some sort of skin in the game. Because if they're commenting on it, then they basically just have an outside opinion that they don't even really understand what they're talking about. When we're at the gym and we're trying to get our dream body, for example, we're trading time and comfort in for uncomfort and pain by pushing ourselves, by sweating, by doing things that kind of suck every single day in order to get this body that we want. But that's skin in the game. Someone that's starting a business could easily go get a nice paying job that's gonna be stable, that's gonna provide enough to put food on the table, but it's gonna be limited in their upside. So if you're starting a business, you're foregoing that security, you're putting aside that surefire bet that you're gonna get paid, and you're taking a risk for a chance that's something that could be an exponential return. Skin in the game is a concept that we have to understand immediately. There's an amazing book on skin in the game called Skin in the Game, Hidden Asymmetries in Life. It's by an author named Nassim Tlaib. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that correctly, but it's fantastic. And if you wanna learn more about the subject, I highly recommend checking it out. Understanding skin in the game has taught me a lot about exponential returns and what I should be investing my risk into and what I shouldn't be. It's also helped me understand that if I wanna learn something about a subject, I need to go to someone that has skin in the game in that subject. Otherwise, it's kinda of just a waste of time. Send this to someone that needs or has skin in the game and wants to learn more about it and why as we all grow together.